all right hi y'all today is <laughs> i don't even know i think it's the 28th today is thursday and i decided i think for the rest of the year for the second half of this year i want to do my breakdown of my paychecks um so yeah let's just talk about it so with this budget book this is my first time having this one um it's been okay it's been okay i really like my other one but this was more cost efficient <laughs> give me one moment i don't want you guys to move too much okay so let me see okay so what i am doing here is <sighs> i just try to go over you know my each paycheck First, I like to do what I expect to receive and then my actual. And then I also like to set up monthly goals. So if you guys can see here, I totally would like to save up $600, $500 to go into like my overall savings and then $100 to go into the 1K, save, uh, 1K savings challenge. I want to make all of my appointments like setting them all up. I want to get all the medical bills together for my insurance claim. I want to go to the gym three times per week. And I want to eat smart. <clears throat> That's a work in progress. But this is in July. <laughs> but I've been doing better, y'all. Um, so let's talk about the money, right? Let's talk about the money. So the first paycheck of the month... I do get paid semi-monthly, so I get paid on the 15th and the last day of the month. So this paycheck, I was expecting $1,600. Um, as you guys can see, my paycheck is only $1,097. So in this paycheck, I do get paid monthly bonuses if I qualify. So this paycheck did have a $765 bonus in there. Thank goodness for that. It kind of helped offset me having a week off um, in this paycheck for my medical. Um, if you guys don't know, I was in a car accident and the urgent care took me out of work um, for a couple of days and then i went to my primary care doctor so in this paycheck there's like f a week worth of pay okay that's missing and i'll update you guys later on about my job the car my injuries my mental health there's a lot of things going on but i'm not going to talk about those just yet um so yeah thank goodness this paycheck had that 765 dollar bonus in there um so yeah here we go um but we're making we're gonna make do with it so looking at the rent for this paycheck i would budget out 500 dollars, but i'm gonna do 100. the thing is and the good thing is i'm prepared for like smaller paychecks as long as I get my other bills paid, rent is covered for up to three months. If I can't cover it with my paycheck, at least I can cover it with my savings. So, yeah, I have three months worth of rent saved up, which is such a beautiful thing. So, I'm going to put 100 towards that. My Capital One Large, we're going to do $15. My Bill Credit Card, $301. My bill credit card has a couple of my bills on there. My work internet this time around is $20 and then it's going to be $50. So with the Verizon, I did qualify for like during the pandemic, like an extra like $30 off with the internet connection thing from the government or whatever that has expired. So I think it's this upcoming paycheck or this upcoming bill that's going to be like $63 but this the actual checking account that this is under it I do have an excess of money of like a hundred dollars so I just put down twenty dollars I didn't know that the bill was going to change until after I wrote this out and I don't want to change it 
um my dominion power and that's on a monthly payment plan i have seen that the amounts are not the same it's varying by like a dollar or two um so yeah that's a little bit different this past year um my discover credit card 15 dollars, and my richmond utilities 20 dollars. so all of that is a uh, 614 dollars. okay gonna bring you guys up a little bit okay oh <laughs> okay all right so let's talk about um the groceries yeah. all right so groceries i like to put 200 dollars aside each paycheck it's me and my son um so yeah 200 dollars per uh per paycheck that's been working out before I think I was going through a lot of, definitely a lot of emotions. Um, you guys know I just got back to work not long ago. Uh, so there's been a lot of like emotions going on. I've been feeling better um, and so forth. So I will say this, the $200 um, per paycheck, I, I don't really track it. I put down 200 whether we stay in that or not sometimes it may vary i don't know because i don't write down each transaction but because of the checking account that this is in this includes like the checking account that this goes in includes like my household the gas and groceries so either way the money covers all of those things if i put it like that Laundry for the month is $40. Dogs will be nothing. They have all of the food that they need um, for like a, hopefully like another month. I probably won't have to get anything until September for them besides like little snacks uh, or treats. Um, house items is $30. Fun and food out will be $60. My allowance $100 which will most likely just go to the Discover credit card because your girl's been spending. Um, hasn't been all emotional spending, not really. But I will say because of this whole accident thing, the issue at my job with my attendance, it's a lot, y'all. I'm not going to cry. It's been a lot. Um... So, I told myself, Desi Banks, on his YouTube, he posted that he's going to be in Richmond, Virginia. So, I was like, you know what, Candace, you need to get out the house. You need to do something for yourself. This has been a lot, right? Um, I took myself to the movies. That was free um, for me to go to the movies. I did that by myself. That was awesome. And I'm just trying to keep doing things for myself. This will be the second comedy show I went to. It was this past Sunday, actually. The ticket was $37. And why I was there this time around, y'all, I had got me a little lemon drop um, martini. And I had got some chicken wings. Oh, both were so good. I'm happy I treated myself. Um, all of that together, I think, was like $32. They add on gratuity already of 18%. Uh, so yeah, it was like $32. Oh my goodness. That was exactly what I needed. That was on Sunday. If you guys have known my emotions, like I would not have been prepared to go to work on Monday in a good mindset. That allowed me to laugh. It allowed me to be happy. It felt good to treat myself with all of everything that's going on. So yeah, this $100 will most likely just go into the Discover credit card, which is fine. Um, gas, I put down $53 for the month. So that will be $483. So the total will be $1,097. So there we go. Not bad, right? And the good thing about this is like, everything outside of my groceries groceries get split up per paycheck but all of these other bills they get paid off with my first paycheck you know so 
the second paycheck of the month is basically me catching up if my rent still needs to be paid you know um i can catch up on that put that money back into the savings to re-up that to make sure i'm back at the three thousand and then you can figure the other part is savings now as you guys can see i do anticipate my hopefully <laughs> i don't know <laughs> Ooh, you guys it's been a lot it's been a lot this whole car accident and uh, uh yeah so if my regular paycheck is okay there's no time off which i doubt there will be any time off but there's going to be 1,400. I'm guessing if it is 1,400, we're going to get caught up on the rent of $900, groceries of $200, and then the savings challenges. Obviously, because the rent is so high to get caught up, it would have to bring this down to 105 for the 1k savings challenge and then the regular savings of 195 dollars i do want to also mention this with any medical bills that are coming up <laughs> okay from all of my doctor's visits pt i'm going to pay those bills out of pocket and just get reimbursed afterwards um so yeah, I'll talk about the whole car thing and everything on a later video. Um, I just don't want to put all of that in here. Um, and I just want to get my mind right. <laughs> As you guys can see, I'm very emotional uh, because it's been a lot. It's, it's not even my fault. And I'm being penalized one way. <laughs> it just seems like I'm just hitting a wall. One after another. One thing see coming up. So um, until everything settles down and I understand what's going on, I will fill you guys in. But for right now, this is my July's goals, my first paycheck budget, and what I expect for next paycheck. So it's like an overall of my full month. And I feel like we can do that, y'all. We can do that. Yeah, we're missing out on like, <laughs> uh, let's say out of that bonus right seven hundred sixty five dollars let's say if i would have brought home after taxes five hundred dollars we're missing out on five hundred dollars right there y'all like yeah five hundred dollars right there and then i would have been able to save up more here it is what it is you guys i can't control that unfortunately right now and um just rolling with the punches so Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are doing well. Um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.